All right, so I'm gonna go in right now and fix a bimalleolar ankle fracture. And so, number one, what does that mean? Number two, why do we have to fix it? So, question number one. A bimalleolar ankle fracture means that there's a fracture on bi equals two. So two malleoli, there's a fracture of the fibula and a fracture of the medial malleolus. Now, the reason that's important is because there's a bone on the inside of the ankle joint called the talus. And when you have two injuries on either side, this talus can shift in and out as it pleases and it's unstable. So that's the reason you have to fix it. Second reason is because the chances of arthritis go up significantly when this bone, the talus, shifts one way or another, typically to the outside laterally. There's a really big hallmark article that most foot and ankle surgeons use. Uh, and essentially what it says is that the contact pressure changes by upwards of 42% with just two millimeters of displacement. So that's a very small margin for error. So whenever this bone, the fibula, is displaced and it's causing that tail is to drift out this way, we always wanna fix it. I'll let you guys know how it goes. Here's the example of the bimalleolar fracture. On the right-hand side, you have the fibula fracture. On the left-hand side, you have a fracture of the medial malleolus. You can see that the talus is translating laterally following the fibula within the mortise. So first, I started off with my fibula fixation. In this particular case, I found that the ankle was going into a little bit more bare, so I actually had to stabilize the medial malleolus first. Once this was stabilized, I was able to secure the fibula, and here's our final result. The comparison x-rays here for the before and after. Let me know if you have any questions or feedback. Take care.